I see somebody running. Yeah, I do too. I see people running. I got two people running. You know, party control. Oh, hey! Hey, drop the gun! Drop the gun! Start running up on us! Put the put the spotlight on him. Gonna be 745 eastbound power. I mean alleyway. Occupied times one red two door Mustang. Santa Grace tag 2066. Yankee Tango whiskey 834 66 YTW 834. Can you put the spotlight spotlight on him? What's the spotlight command? Uh, you can use eight and five to move it. On your number pad? Do you have one? Yeah, I just don't know the command to turn it on. It, it turns on when you put the high oh. beams on. Oh. Yeah, it's not working. Can you see it moving? I see it moving. Oh, I don't see it moving. Oh, oh wait, I do. Yeah. Yeah, it's not, it's not as bright, but yeah. Okay. Alright, you want to talk to him? Because I barely saw yep. what happened. I'll just, I'll just get the flashlight on. How you doing, sir? Wrong. I'm sorry. Here's my All right. Okay. Any reason that you're driving so fast today, man? No, I just see there's a really. pending assignment coming on the leak. All right, just sit tight for me. Is there anything in the vehicle you need to know about? Any weapons? Anything no. like that? What thing is anything? No, not at all. Let's see. All right. All right. Just go ahead and sit tight for me, okay? Hey, guys, can you show me 10, 7, 10, 4, 2? We are issuing it. Action 14 to 27, 42, 10, 7, 0, 2, 35, Yankee Tango Whiskey. Vehicles unregistered. There is. Yeah, it says uh, bill of sale purchased today by rear okay. right. Oh, I didn't see that. Okay. How are you doing, officer? I'll be 10, just sit, go ahead and sit tight there for me. I ain't talking to you, but... I turn my car back on, it's pretty hot. Nope. Leave it off. That's gotta be racist. Anyway, um... Cool. Are, are you serious, bud? Are you serious? Control for Bravo 100. I'll be honest. User disconnected All right. from your team. I, I, you have the right to remain silent. I suggest you exercise that right at this time. Because right now you're just clearly looking to offend me. And, um, yeah, that ain't gonna be good for you, so... I need you to relax. Can I take my glasses off? No, keep your hands on the steering wheel. You want to bring that race game? I'm going to show you the race game. Whoa. Yo. There's an ammunition around the car. All righty, sir. What I'm going to do for you today, I'm going to give you a citation. All right, it's going to be for the traffic light violation. I also could get you for the speed, but I don't have you clocked. You need to just okay. slow down for me, all right? Yeah, it's it's cool. nighttime. It's dark. You know, you actually People almost you were very jobs. close to my vehicle when you yeah, came through that intersection. All right, go inside and bomb the ticket. Not a mission of guilt, just knowledge that you spoke to an officer today. All right, if you do choose to attest this ticket, court information as well as my badge information will my partner's bottom. All right, I'm going to give you your information back. Can you tell that officer I'm sorry if I offend him? Yeah, I'll let him know. I'm going to give you your information back as soon as I get back in my vehicle and turn my lights off, you're all set to go. Alright, thank you. Caitlin, do a that stupid race card, bro. Yeah. Four bar, one hundred dispatch. Four bar, one hundred dispatch. Show me the code of six here. Unit 40 control. Unit 40 gun. Let me clear off that traffic, 745, back in service. Oh, we have more shots fired, okay. It's probably ammunition, yeah. Let's just, let's just pass by me, sure nobody's shooting at each other. Yeah. Hold on, is that his ass right here? Yes, it is. I got your ass, boy. I see somebody running. Yeah, I do too. I, see people running. I got two people running. You know, 40 control. 
Oh. Hey. hey, that homeless man has a knife. That homeless man has a knife. Hey, drop homeless the man. gun. Drop the gun. Stop running up on us. Whoa. Drop the gun. Whoa. Drop the gun. Whoa. Do not run up on us like that. Drop the gun. Drop the gun. Hey, you're off duty cop, right? Drop the fucking gun, bro. Put your hands up. Drop the weapon. Drop dude. the gun. Put your hands up. Face away. Face away, dude. One out of on one. We knees. got uh one male running. On your knees. We got one male shot at this time. Seven five two ammunition. Elgin Avenue. Don't move. Stand by. Calling in ten seventy seven. My arm. These shots fired. We got three males at gunpoint. One in custody. The other two are gonna be in custody shortly. Stand up for me. I hear having to yell at people. Get up, sir. With a gun in his hand. Where are you shot? In my arm. Okay. Do you have anything on you? Pull me, stick me, or hurt me? Maybe I might have a needle. Okay. Anything, I'm gonna patch you down. Can you take him and put him in your car, please? All right, I'm gonna talk to you here right now, right, and let you know what's going on. I don't respect somebody that's saying that they're off duty cop running up on cops who are on duty and firing and having your gun in your hand. When I tell you, when I tell you to put your gun down, you're giving me resistance. That's never going to happen, especially as an off duty cop. Do you understand what I'm telling you? I didn't mean to resist you, officer. When I tell you to put your hands up, you better put your damn hands up, bro. I ain't playing that game. I'm here to make the scene secure. So when you're rolling up on me with my gun in my hand, in, in your hand, I don't know who you are. I don't know what's going on, and I'm gonna take scene com command. So if you're gonna sit here and resist me, then I'm gonna put you under arrest. You understand that? I'm sorry, I did not mean to resist. <laughs> Stay tight for me. Can I get yes, your statement, please? All right, one so, out of one, um, control. The man over there in the white tank top walks what into I this weapon go. store. And Can I have medical down here? 752 Elgin Avenue for one mil hit with a GSW to the arm. <laughs> Sit tight for me, sir. Where's the knife? The store, man. It's a small pocket knife. Okay. Hey, boss. Which, which, uh... At that point, he runs out of the store with the knife. Control one alpha one direct. Your turn. Go ahead. Back ten ten fifty two nine ten twenty six one. Ten four. Thank you. Oh, that's cool. One out two one out one. Go ahead. Do you want me to leave the cuffs on the white tank cop? 10 4, I'm pretty sure he uh, brandished a weapon at them. I believe he said it was a pocket knife. 10 4, I'm still looking around for a pocket knife. I haven't found anything yet. 10 4, I believe he said it was in the ammunition. It's possible. How I can ask again? 10 4, I just asked him looking around for it. Do we have a description of the uh, homeless man? The advised 911 call provided no 1043 as to the description of the homeless man. 1 out of 1, 4 Bravo 100, direct. Go ahead. I'm, I'm pretty sure I got your homeless man down here at uh, 745 at his Apple Boulevard.
So the homeless man pulled out a knife because uh, he was angry, and then the guys oh. pulled out a weapon. Um, wait a minute. Oh, sorry, sorry. Okay, so the guys, the so when uh the guy was banging on the the glass, the homeless guy, the two individuals in the ammunition pulled their weapons, yeah, uh, because they were just afraid, you know, something was gonna happen. Homeless man felt he feared for his life, so he pulled his knife. Officer, um, can I get my statement? When he pulled the knife, stop talking. They shot. They fired at the uh, the homeless subject. They ran outside. The subject over there who called nine one one, uh, they were still shooting and running. Um, when the guy had the knife, so basically it's. I don't, it's not really self-defense. I mean, whoever shot at whoever shot at him while he was running away is gonna get arrested today. Yeah, that's definitely the so-called off-duty officer in the back. Right. right. Um. So what what I got from my subject sitting on my car, uh, he so he said that he was in the gun store trying to buy a gun while the while the owner was pointing a weapon at the homeless man while as he pulled out a knife. And the um, subject that I have uh, backed up in the corner um, saying, whoa, whoa, whoa. And then the man with the knife charged at the owner. Um, the owner uh, didn't fire any shots. And then he charged at my subject over there with the knife. And he fired two shots that missed. And then the uh, homeless man ran outside and got shot. All right, medical personnel. Okay, I'm going to take the firearm in the back of my car and run a... Uh test kit on it see if it's been recently fired um if you can get a gsr test kit and run it on his fingers see if it coincides with the firearm yep definitely nope, you're thank you right i'm gonna run my what? footage back <laughs> all right see if i can identify who was the one that shot all right so that guy i saw him right here and he fired his firearm right down that road where the off-duty cop guy was in his crossfire. And I'm like, why are you shooting down there? And the guy's running away from you. I would understand if he was in the middle of the... The guy was in front of him charging him with a knife or whatever. But that's... that's uh, To me, that's intent to, to murder right there. Yeah, Attempt to murder. Far away. There's no way that that's uh, justifiable. It's, it really isn't. So I'm going to go over it again to make sure that I got the ID on the correct person. But I'm pretty sure it's that guy that, that shot at him. So, I'm going to review okay. it one more time. Alright, I'm going to go inside see if I can find any shell casing from the officer's firearm. Okay. Also, if that's his service pistol, then that's a whole separate issue. Yeah, it is. Alright, it was definitely him that shot that guy. Alright, yeah, that guy's going to jail. Uh, that guy is, that I told you to put in the car earlier. His, he shot the guy... He shot, see where the stairs are by the ammunition? Yeah. So he was just a little bit further right there, probably by where those trash bags are. And the guy was up there in that bush, like near that bush. There's no he way that that's self-defense. Yeah, he shot one shot at him. That's, that's... Actively running away. Yeah, he, the guy was actively running away. I wouldn't understand if the person was like right in his face and charging with a knife. But that right there, that's attempted murder in my, in my eyes. Oh no, one one hundred percent. Or was, at least he was like running at him. Or at least reckless operation of a firearm. I mean, he was. That's that's one of the number one rules of gun safety. You don't point your gun at something unless you intend to kill it. So. Exactly. On top of that, they he had somebody else in his crossfire right there, which was this guy in in the uh, in the car. Yeah. Well, and not to mention the countless civilians or locals that are all around. Over one hundred and one. I'm behind there, so. Uh, the subject in your vehicle like to make a statement. I'm still wrapping up with this guy over here. They, they can wait. They can 100% wait. 10-4, he can wait. I told him I'd get to him when I can. 10-4, uh, advise one out one. I can hear me on all the way from over here. <laughs> User joined your channel. Alright, so he, the, um, the guy that's sitting over there with the gunshot wound. Yeah. Um, so he said that's his car. He said that he just bought it from somebody. That car that's illegally parked on the curb over there? Yes, it's not registered to anyone. Uh, but he said that he just oh, bought it from some guy. He said the bill of sale is in there. Okay. Okay, so what are we... We got to look at the footage and see what happened inside the ammunition as well. Because we, 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 didn't, we don't know what happened inside of there that caused all of this. Yeah. So, oh, sir, I can give you that... Yep, we're gonna take you out of the car, you're gonna walk us uh, into the ammunition, you're gonna give us that footage. Uh, Alright. Oh, I'm willing to, because I don't, you know. 
Um, I'm going to move my um, car. When I go inside, I need to not be. Yeah, let's move it to the yeah, side. Yep. Control calling from Bravo 100. Go ahead. Officer. Yeah, 1027, your scene, sir. Officer. Be advised, my scene is tied into the one at. No, it's not. 752. I have. My team is still open at home. And Harp. Are you the clerk here? No, I was a witness. Okay. Sit tight for me. Okay. I gave my uh, statement to the guy with the gray hair, or white hair, whatever you want to call it. Okay. Bro, who keeps messaging me on TeamSpeak? Stay right there. Mikey, can you watch that guy? What's up? So, do you uh, want me to go ahead and get a statement from the guy that is in the back of my car, or what yeah, you yeah, you can do that. With a thing of more he says that he's being relax, relax, relax. No, I I know what I saw. Yeah, I can only imagine what his statement's gonna be. So, I'll, I'll let's listen to it. Control calling for brother. Am I able to leave? Go ahead. Hey, guys, County Two Fifty Two and Ten Twenty Six. Go get stuff at this cancer. One second. Let me open the door. Ten Four. All right, boss, let's hear your statement. All right. So, when we were inside the ammunition, I, I, I shot him twice while he was charging towards me with a knife in his hand. And, um, okay. And that would be in self-defense, correct? That part, yes. Um, and as we were going outside, as we were running um, towards him, as I was on the stairs, I must have, like, jumped down a few stairs because my firearm accidentally went off. It kind of slipped my mind in the heat of the moment. You know, police being here, I'm not involved with the police that much, but my firearm did fire outside, but it was accidental. It was unintentional. Accidentally, you t you accidentally took aim at somebody down the street and fired directly at them, right? I did not, I did not take aim. But you shot directly at the guy. I have no clue where it went, but I accidentally fired my weapon. From where it looks to me is that you came right out of the uh, ammunition with the other two guys, and y'all were chasing that guy, which the guy in the cowboy hat was first, and he was probably somewhere on the, the sidewalk right here, whereas the other guy was down the... What is that? Right, the other guy was over here, and then a shot came from you and your firearm right down the road that way. So, yes, sir, it did come from my firearm, but I did not mean to fire the weapon. It was okay, not my intention to fire the weapon is that out of state, not your intention, or you mean not intention in uh, in state? Hey, uh, the, the medical said that you should stand. Yeah, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, in state. 
Just give me more. Okay. So we the neck with the more. Well, unfortunately, at this time, I'm gonna still be arresting you at this time because that's gonna be reckless operation of a firearm. You understand that? Disconnected from your channel. You could have easily hit and killed somebody. Um, without you didn't have proper gun um etiquette right there especially after you didn't you guys didn't need to chase the guy down especially with guns in your hand so yeah give me a second i got you but you also endangered the guy in the cowboy hat so unfortunately um i'm still gonna be arresting you i'm gonna knock it down from attempted murder to reckless operation of a firearm yes sir all right, sit tight for me. All right, so basically to give you the gist of the uh, CCTV, the guy was very agitated. The clerk pulled a weapon to defend Which his guy? Property. Tank top? Uh, yeah, the, the tank top guy was agitated. The clerk in the back of my car, the cowboy hat guy, pulled a weapon. Um, and then Hey, hey. They fired rounds inside the hey, ammunition. Calm it down. Oh, so it's, 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 it's not attempted murder, but it, yeah, this guy should go in for uh, hey, negligence hey, as well. The the one the one in the back of your of the S4. Yeah. No, the okay. back in the back of my charger. So wait wait wait. wait. Let me get this straight. Um, hold on. Nope. Yes, man. I need a morphin to a Power Ranger. Um, shows got yeah, behind the counter standing, pinching the sickness from again, a white tag, it's a to ask for a change, the white thing. Because of fire and just, uh, nice. Just to clarify, the clerk is the one, uh, in the cowboy hat. In the charger, yeah. Yes, sir. The Subject. guy in black is in my car back here. Okay. And then white tank top is. White tank top. Morphine. What is wrong with him? I need him to stab me in the neck of morphine. Uh, bring the jugular man, please. I need a morph into a Power Ranger. Uh, do we know how this this red Mustang is related? Can I please give a statement? So uh, he was the original uh, one color. Uh, 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 uh. So the clerk unjustfully shot at the guy. Is the guy wait? Did the guy have the nightfall at any point in time? No. The uh, like the guy in the white tank top was agitated so the guy pulled a weapon because i guess he felt threatened that's what it looks like in the footage he bashed my he counter like destroyed my property yeah he was he was slamming on the counter nothing broke okay. though you, okay I, uh, I hear you, the man. thing my is is that uh, the counter, counter had a shard nothing. in it it was shattered it did oh, not it, it did not stop. relax both of you guys need to stop talking no, first of all the guy in the back of my charger the windows are shut i don't know how you're hearing anything all right i'll be quiet Hey, Micah, go ahead and go ahead and back up. Your Do not car roll up my windows. Mine. Do not roll up my windows. And hits the and, telephone. Well, that's uh, coming no, on his paycheck. Anyway. <laughs> okay. Um. So this guy in the back of our car is going in for what? He's going in reckless. for reckless. I would say that's attempted murder because he was. That was not a justified Please shooting. Joined your channel. I definitely okay. wasn't a justified shooting. He shot the guy. That's attempted. So when, when, when did the did the guy pull out a knife or what? The guy uh, pulled out a knife after this uh, clerk pulled a weapon. Yeah, oh, uh, my so guy was saying um, gun for, oh, So he yeah, pulled yeah. the gun first. Yeah, he pulled the uh, knife in self defense. Apparently, he in his mind he believes you're supposed to bring knives to a gunfight. Yeah. Okay. Well, that clearly didn't work out too well for him. Yeah, and he said uh, when he. Uh, when he was going to put the knife down, he stumbled forward, and that's when shots started ringing out. Okay. Okay. Well, that's that's attempted then for him. Reckless for the other guy. Ooh, that copper going to jail for a mm. All right. So the that guy, guy, the guy in that guy is the original one caller. Yeah. So, so we're going. We're getting this guy for reckless. Reckless operation of firearm. This guy in this car for attempted murder and reckless. And um, I think that should be it. White tank top didn't commit crimes, right? No. And then no, the, uh, but... the subject over there is just not one color. Okay, we'll let the, the subject in the um, uh, in white tank top go with the uh, medics down to the hospital. We'll take the other two guys in. Alright. Well, which means we need to call medical unit back. Yeah. One out of one control. Alright, I'm gonna let this guy go. Ow. Oh, damn. Hey, uh, 
Can I please give my statement, officer? Yes, sir, he is. Go ahead. Uh, somebody take his statement. Uh, we can uh, have, um, can I have a 1052 back down here, 745, transport one mil to medic to the hospital. Uh, we can also have two 1015 at this time. Uh, we'll be 1065 shortly. Go ahead and step off the roof. Come over here. So, so, uh, go ahead and give me your statement. So, I'm sitting in the, I'm sitting in the ammunition. Go ahead. So, I'm sitting in the ammunition. Go for it, thank you. Gun dealer, he saves Andreas. We have the fire. And the counter open. We charge, blah, blah. I'm waiting there. The guy in the white walks in and hey, can I have change? I said, no, sir, we cannot give you change. He then says, can I have a gun? I was like, legally not give you a gun. He then gets agitated and pounds on my counter. Um, User breaking left your a channel. Bit. Not like, you know, break, break, but you know, it shatters a little bit from the force. So I then pull out my firearm, trying to defend my property, since I'm only a manager, it's it's not, it's, um, I do not own the place. What was the name and the I tell the guy in the black to call black. the cops. As he's on the phone with 911, he's like, he's all this freaking time. out and everything. He then pulls out a knife. Then he maps to get some um, fingerprints on him. Runs outside, and then runs back, and then he starts walking towards me. I'm just, and he, oh, about like right, walking towards me. So I put three rounds, I put um, three rounds, not trying to kill him, but trying, you know, to get him to stop. He then walks towards the guy in the black. Oh, the guy in the black, I believe, fires twice. User sure. joined your channel. He then runs as you guys are rolling up. He then runs, and I, I I don't have my gun drawn. I have it on the side of my um, I have it in my hand on the side, and I try to go up to the office where I do admit I did mess up as I should have holstered it or put it on the counter. But also, if I put it on the counter, it would have been a loaded gun in the open. So I admit I should have put it in my holster, and I ran up to the cops trying to you know, and then I hear a gunshot behind me. I don't know who fired, but I hear a gunshot behind me. And I go up to the cops trying to say, you know, what's going on? I get put at gunpoint, I put back in the car. I'm not able to say anything. And I'm being told I'm going to jail and I'm probably going to lose my job. Both jobs, actually. You're still, you're still pointing a gun at somebody unjustfully. That's all he I'm just, hearing. He, 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 just, he destroyed my um, counter. Yeah, but you don't point a gun at him because but, he destroyed uh, a I, counter. But he, but he destroyed my property, so I'm defending my property. That's not justifiable to point a gun at somebody. What do you? So if safe, uh, no, no, no disrespect. Okay, safe, I'm not arguing safe, with you. Safe, 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 no, I'm, I'm, I'm not arguing with you. I'm no, you I'm not arguing with you. Turn around. I'm asking. You. Turn around. I ain't arguing with you. So you're telling me, if you accidentally break a plate at a restaurant, you get, you can point a gun at someone. Oh my god, like, I don't understand how that makes any point of sense, but you know what? I I'm not playing this game. He's going to jail today. Yeah. Wait, so what What did he claim? Sorry, I was doing paperwork. What did he claim was the reason? He's he's claiming that because the guy cracked his, his cabinet or his um his his case with, with, you know, with force, that justifies him pulling a gun and pointing at the person. No. Yeah, and then... He and then on broke a, he barely broke a counter. He can't do that much damage to where it's necessary to pull user a disconnected from your yeah. Account. I would understand this if he broke the counter, took up a gun, etc., etc. But he no, just he broke the, the counter. If he pulled the knife first, then I would understand that exactly. But all he did was smash a counter. That's when you call the cops and have him trespass. Exactly. So and then he's sitting here and trying to argue with me. I ain't. I ain't. I ain't playing that. Yeah, no, I'm gonna hand him with reckless as well. Okay. We're gonna revoke his firearm license. Okay.
Also, yeah, Chad, you're going to want to file that with the reports considering he is an off-duty officer. Oh, I'm the chief. You know, you know, that's not going to go very well. Yeah, I, I feel that. All right, All right we well, get to go we'll from here. We'll, yeah, yeah, we'll transport right. him. Yo, me to just meet you on the station? Yeah. yeah. This guy. One another one control. Who does this belong to? Good. What is it? All right, sir. That Dodge Caravan. For oh, I Can I have uh, 1051 down here, 745 for a uh, two SUVs? Copy, you're requesting two times, can I 1050, or are you requesting just one for the both? Um, let's get two 1051s down here. Sorry, I was in my head. What? Control, uh, what are your rights? You know your rights? Okay, what's your name? What's the name on this? Keaton 40, go ahead. Hey, can I, uh, two times, can I take you one in route? Team 26 can be unknown. Definitely, thank you. Did I? Oh, I didn't put that right. Then there's Dodge Caravan. One on two, one on one direct. Go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, head off the station. I'll just meet y'all there. Ten four. One on two control. But I'm two. Go ahead. Is it? Show me 1065 MRPD. One out of one to end all any unit on scene. Um, this, uh, this person, this caravan is registered to a regiment on Tarius. Is that anybody's, uh, suspects? Okay. At this time, you are going to be placed under arrest for reckless operation of a firearm as well as... Negative. The individual I have in my car said he walked here. His name's John and Paula. You're going to have no, no for. bail for this, uh, uh situation. Negative. Alright, we can go. Alright. I love it when people try to join our server and they realize it's whitelisted. I'll be back in it. Officer. Show me ten six MRPD. What's up? What's the definition of self defense, please? Is he talking? Yes, he's asking what's the definition of self defense. No disrespect. Oh, I can't even hear him. I'm not answering that question. Show me 10, yeah. 7, 10, 42. Everybody have a good night. Copy showing me. That ain't, that ain't self defense. Yeah, no way. Have a good night. Actually, I am going to answer his question. To Here answer your question, sir, self-defense is a countermeasure that involves defending the health and well-being of oneself from harm. The use of the right of self-defense is a legal just justification for a use of force in terms in times of danger is available in many jurisdictions. Thank you. Okay, so you weren't being harmed. It was your property, not you. I'm, I'm, I'm saying. 
But he was damaging my property. So that doesn't give you the right to shoot him or pull a gun on him. He came towards me with a knife. He came with a knife after you pulled your That's firearm. That's because he damaged, he damaged my property. You pulled you the gun pull first. On someone. Sir, you don't pull That's not how it works. Because they break your counter. You call the cops and let them handle it. And if you went through your gun safety classes, you would know that. And as a law enforcement officer, you should know that as well. Definitely, 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 definitely